Economists have long been talking about the possibility of a new financial crisis for the EU, but few would expect this European country of contributing to a downturn. Over a dec for over a decade, the country in question has seen less economic growth than the Eurozone average. Productivity has barely increased in the last few years. Two out of three workers earn less than they did in 2000. And according to a leading European economist, it's not indebted Portugal or Greece, but Europe's economic powerhouse, Germany. The head of the German Institute for Economic Research says the situation isn't as bright as we've been told. Artis Peter Alva reports. Germany has been forced to revise its projected economic growth for the foreseeable future. Forecasters had predicted that Germany's economy would grow by 1.9% in 2014 and a further 2% in 2015. Now they've had to go back and revise those estimates. Germany should grow by about 1.3% this year, 1.2% in 2015. Now, Economists at the top level are saying that this is, well, no coincidence when it comes alongside the ongoing crisis in Ukraine and the sanctions that have been imposed. It is the nature of sanctions that they hurt, and they do not only hurt the other party, it hurts yourself. 3.5% of German exports go to Russia. That sounds little, but 7.9% uh, go to the United States of America, so it's, these numbers tend to be small. And uh, many German firms have contacts with Russia, so in general the business expectations have calmed down. So it is still growth for Germany, but as the Eurozone as a whole looks to kind of stagnate economically at the moment, one thing that is really of concern to those keeping a close eye on this is the threat of a potential triple dip recession, which could plunge everybody in the Eurozone back into the crisis that we've seen in the past few years.